Hey, it's Nina from Worship Piano Tutorials, and I'll be showing you how to play the song Transfiguration by Hailsong Worship. So you start off with an intro. It looks like this. It's a D minor, F, C, and then G sustained. So very quick, simple introduction. I'm playing an uh, inverted chord, so D minor. And instead of playing it like this, I'm playing it like that. And then same with F, it's inverted. Inverted C and G sustain. And then going into the verse, you have identical chords. So you have a D minor, F, C, and G sustain. So verse, D minor. From the cloud you speak, F, going to C, what was real now is C, G sustained, going to D minor, Jesus the image of F, going to C, the invisible God, verse 2. So those are the verses for you. Of course, a regular piano like a grand or upright or any other key keyboard with a little bit of synth would sound a lot better than this because this is kind of empty, but it's just my keyboard sound. It's kind of cheap. Um, so going to the chorus, the chords are F, D minor, A minor, and G. So very simple, they repeat again. F, D minor, A minor, G. So, uh, Going from the verse into the chorus looks like this. Earth now Going to F. Holy is the Lord revealed before my eyes. D minor. Going to A minor. And my burning heart can scarcely take it in. G. Going to F. As I behold your beauty with unworthy eyes. And the only song my soul can find to sing and then going into the chorus so um hallelujah the chords for that are f g c and then f again so the only song my soul can find to sing now going to the chorus f is hallelujah Hallelujah, hallelujah, my King. You could also do this song, uh, solo. Hallelujah, 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 my King. So the way that solo um, during the chorus looks like, it's a C, D, E. A for the first time for the F chord and then when you switch to the G chord you're going to be playing C D E D C B and then when you go to the E chord you're going to be playing C D E D C G and then when you're going to be going back to the F it's C D E D C A so That's for the first chorus, it's down here. When you're going to be doing the second chorus, it's up here, so. So that's how you'll be doing the second time around. With your left hand, you know, what I do is just like kind of like a 
first, fifth, eighth, and then fifth, eighth, first, fifth, eighth, fifth, eighth, to kind of fill in the solo blank, so... with the left hand um so how you play that together is as soon as you press that first with your left hand you're going to start right after with your right hand so for example so it's not at the same time it's right after so g c f so right after the left hand you're going to be doing it with your right hand so fairly simple, not too hard. Um, and then you go into verse three right after the chorus. So my key, going to G minor. Lead my longing heart to a high ground, to the clear. So um, you want to be pressing a little, giving it a more bass than first time around. So, for example, pressing octaves instead of just one key. So, and I'll, I'll be there, holding you. And then into pre chorus F. Holy is the Lord revealed before my eyes. So, you might be pressing on the um, keys a little more often if you're just doing solo piano, right? So, holy is the I'm just pressing four times the measure, right? With my left hand, I'm pressing once or twice, you know? Then you're going to the hallelujah again, and we talked about this. You're going to be doing the high version of that solo, so... Hallelujah, 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 my king. So it took me a lot of practice to actually play it and sing it, and I'm still messing up, so... You know, if you're playing and singing it, really get it down. And if you're playing for someone who's singing, then, you know, it's going to be easier for you. All right, and then going into the instrumental after that chorus. So there's kind of two parts to the uh, instrumental. There is an electric guitar stance that you can take and play this. Um, for example, Hallelujah, my king. And play this. part of the instrumental that you could do or you could do like the same kind of instrumental like so it kind of depends on you the chords for the instrumental though are F G C and F same as the chorus so um, the instrumental if you're doing the piano part they go really fast it's something like Like, they like do it twice. Anyway, it's really complicated. I mean, I'm sure if you're doing the piano part in a band, you'd probably want to do this part. So it's, uh, it's like, so you pretty much add these three once again after one part. So. And you just add this, and then you do the next part, and then you add these three again. Anyway, it sounds really good though with a band, but if you're not doing a band, you're just doing solo piano, I just suggest you to just do this, kind of instrumental. And with my left hand, I'm just doing a, like a flowy style, I'm again just doing the first, fifth, eighth, fifth, eighth, fifth, eighth, first, fifth, you know. Just playing around with those, you know, fifths and eights and firsts again. Just going back and forth. All right, and then going into the bridge, the chords are A minor, F, C, and 
and G. And then D minor, F, C, and G. So how that looks like is uh, after the, you know, instrumental, you go into the F, and then you go into the A minor. Now I know I have seen F, your glory that cannot be You saw how I build up. So first I was playing the bass key like once and I was pressing with my right hand like four times a chord per measure. And then I, the second time around I started pressing on the bass key like eight times. So that really adds to, you know, building up. Um, of course if you have a bass player it's easier for you. You don't really have to do much because the drums and everything build up. But if you're just doing piano, you really need that bass. Um, so after the bridge, um, you could go back to the cho the um, chorus. I mean, the pre-chorus and then chorus. So, and believe. So when you end the bridge, she goes really high. Look upon the Lord and believe. And pre-chorus. Holy is the Lord revealed before my eyes. So you go back to the pre-chorus and then chorus, of course. Um, hallelujah. And then she goes high. Hallelujah. 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 And then the ending is so gorgeous. It's like, So gorgeous. She goes from like high first voice, then second, and then low first voice. Anyway, gorgeous song. I hope you really um, get into God's presence and really worship Him and just see His glory through this song.